I think you look so good today. You've got like a real like cute little edgy look. You've got the, you've got the nose ring. You've got the tail <laughs> on the inside of the arm. Thanks, oh, you've got the rings as well. You've got the full knuckle duster. I do. Just Jeez, okay. man. But I don't know if you know, all the football's cancelled. Oh, yeah. So I'm kind of like a bit down on my luck. Yeah, you know, <laughs> you're like the second best option to like Newcastle West Ham. So you should, <laughs> you should feel like pretty honoured about that. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, you don't know this man, but you'll know him by the end of the video. So this is George. Hey guys. We worked together over a year ago, didn't we? Yeah, a little over a year ago. And yeah, we did like a couple of sessions together, been mates since then. And we wanted to make a video today, which is around the topic of what to do if you've not done any of this stuff for a little while, yeah? If you want to get back on the horse, you had a little bit of a hiatus. So before we get going, if you want to just explain to the people what situation you're in at the moment, when the last time you actually went out to do any sort of day game cold approach. So I haven't done any cold approach for like five, six weeks. And even then it was quite light. So I've kind of like, I'm in like a bit of like a petering down stage right now. Um, but anyway, Christian's back for a month or so from his like, international playboy lifestyle. So while he's here, I want to like help him out because like, I obviously had to say this to you off camera, yeah, I have a little bit, but your fucking sound, like when I first started a game, you was just giving it like encouragement, encouragement. And yeah, we're boys, but like, I don't forget like that. That was like so priceless. Because when you first out, like you're getting fucking kicked in the teeth. Can I swear? Can you swear? Yeah. Too fucking right, you can swear. Have I mean, you not watched this channel before? <laughs> you could do like a dolphin, like <laughs> every time, every time, every, 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 every time, teeth. every time I cuss. You can fucking swear. But yeah, <laughs> keep it, yeah, not lightly. But anyway, I, pr I appreciate that a lot. And I think you've helped me out so much. I wouldn't be where I'm at, which isn't like the heights of game, but I've moved really far and I'm really happy. And I just kind of want to show my thanks to you because obviously it's a big deal. Like I'm like mic'd up right now. I'm going to get, I'm be getting filmed. Like this is a, this is a bit crazy. But I want to show my thanks to you by kind of giving something back, you know? Casting overnight, laying down his knees. No, I'm not actually hitting the knees. It's fine, we can do that. <laughs> That's off camera. Okay. Oh yeah, 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 of course. Cut to knees, back, um, anyway, back in now. Yeah, yeah. Um, so anyway, we're just going to go about today. I've, I've done nothing, I'm super cold. I've literally spent this morning by myself. I'm expected to be like, I'm ex not expecting a lot when I first start, but we're just going to give it a go. And I want to like, show you guys back home as well, wherever you're watching this, maybe on your commute. Like, it doesn't matter, get started. Like, it's, this is what it's like for everyone. Like, you think your situation is the worst, you're the most fearful, keep plugging away. No one ever really wants to do this. Like, no one ever really wants to come out here and put themselves through the social fire. Yeah. And you don't need to feel as though you, you, you have to be in that state to want to do it. You'll want to do it when you actually can't hear and start doing it. So the first couple of conversations that you have today, you're probably going to have a little bit of resistance there. Yeah. You're probably going to think these are not the poetic masterpieces that I want. I know that I'm capable of. Yeah, like they don't even count. Don't mm. like just remove any ego or pride from them. Just yeah. go in with the mindset of putting a smile on someone's face yeah. and getting yourself into the, the, the right state of mind. Yeah, exactly. And even like, like exactly like in further to that, me even just being like mic'd up, camera on me, this is going on the internet. Mm -hmm. If you'd have said that to me in my first two weeks, oh, we're going to do this, I would have shit myself. Mm -hmm. But even this is just being able to like, right, I'm owning what I believe. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be myself. I mean no, I mean no harm. Just living your life, trying to spread a bit of joy, and just take it for what it is, you know. Okay. What's going through your head at the moment? I think right now, mm -hmm. stress for sure is building. Mm -hmm. a bit of the occasion, uh, but. I'm keeping myself. Now, nah, to be fair, I'm probably playing out a little bit of scenarios, but then I'm kind of like noticing that, and then I'm just stop doing that. I'm not getting. I don't want to get like too scanny. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Too in, too like hyper invested. So. Yeah. The probably, way probably a little bit of stress to be fair. That's fine. But it's okay. Like, the way the way that you feel now isn't yeah. going to be the way that you feel in like 20 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. For after, sure. after you've had a few of them, you'll be like, oh, this is all right now. Yeah. I think you just got to like, yeah. Run the furnace a little bit, take some L's, mm -hmm. move on. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to Hey, sorry. I know you're like on the way. I'm sure you got, I'm sure you're like really busy. But I think you look so good today. Oh, thank you. I love like that dress. I don't know, like, orange is genuinely my favorite color. Oh. Yeah. Thank yeah, you, you look good. You. Yeah, you're really welcome. You have, you have a really nice day, okay? Yeah, thank you. Thanks. Bye. <laughs> there was a really, there was a, there was a really subtle camera. <laughs> hey, he's got, he's got, he's got the angle. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. But no, well done, because it's it's not an easy thing to just go into it. 
and you'll feel you'll you'll feel slightly better for doing that. So well yeah. Hey, excuse me. Sorry. I'm sure you're like really, really busy, but I just saw you kind of like half glance. You look great. Oh, thank you. Want to come say hi? Oh, thanks. You're welcome. Um, you got like a bit. You put gone. Oh, what did you say? I was gonna say you got like a real like cute little edgy look. You got the you got the nose ring. You got the tail <laughs> on the inside of the arm. Well, thanks. Oh, you um, got the rings as well. You got the full knuckle duster. Jeez, man, I better keep my distance in case you throw, throw hands at me. Um, yeah, I'm trying to see someone, but thank you. You have a lovely day, okay? L's in the chat, L's in the chat. Good. Oh, that will feel. You know what, it's nice to take an L. I like, you know. Mm -hmm. I feel like everyone loves the W's, but, <laughs> you know. It's the L's that make you grow. L's just, L's keep you hungry, if anything. No, the W's keep you hungry. Well, I think both can, can't they? One of them, you can get pissed off and be like, oh, cool, I want to do better. Yeah. And then when it's going good, it's like, I want to do more, so. But you need to value both. Mm. There's no point in doing anything in this world if it's all just win, 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 win. Well then, well, the win's got no meaning then, Char has it? Yeah, exactly. Characters, the character building is, you know, is done in the L's. <laughs> I can't believe I'm making a philosophical point around L's, 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 W, 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 <laughs> Hey, hey, sorry, can I stop you for one second? Yeah, I know, like, I'm sure you're busy. It's my Sunday. I tried looking at you as I walked past. Uh but you were giving me nothing back. Oh, sorry. So I had to like double back. Yeah, you, you look really good. Oh, thank you. What's your name? Okay. My friend's called But he's like a six foot three Bangladeshi guy. Oh, a bit different. So it's like, yeah, it's like huge contrast. Yeah. yeah. How are you doing? Yeah, good. What's your name? George. Nice to meet you. You from around here? Yeah. Okay, nice. I live Where? I live Is that? Mm. Nice. What do you think I said? <laughs> I don't know, but you know when it, when it, like, it sounds like a few words to me. Yeah, when you like meet someone for like the first time and it's like new, the words just do not come out and they come out a little bit jumbled and you just pray to God like they can decipher what they can. <laughs> like, you just hope like they kind of get the context. So you just have the day? Yeah, I've got like a uh, six course dinner lunch thing in Canary Wharf at six. That's nice. But I don't know if you know, all the football's cancelled. Oh yeah. So I'm kind of like a bit down on my luck. Yeah, you know, you're like the second best option to like Newcastle West Ham. So you should, you should feel like pretty honoured about that. Yeah. Um, how old are you? 24. Oh, really? Okay. How old are you? 27. Do you think I look it or no? <laughs> you're so what? <laughs> you're making me feel so old. Oh, really? You feel shy? Yeah. Oh, wow. Sorry. I can look like this just help make it any better. Oh, you make me shy. <laughs> Sorry, do you, not, do you not talk to guys often? Or are they more like? Is it, is it, is it more like? <laughs> yeah, you should do though, don't you think? Don't you think all women should? Yeah, why not? Yeah, fuck it, why not, it's you know? Nice. The more like kind of interactions you make, the more like likely you are to like find the one, you know? Yeah, very true. It's like, what is it, princess and the, you've got to kiss a lot of frogs to meet the prince. <laughs> if you only kiss one, if you give yourself the courtesy of one kiss, it's almost definitely going to be a frog. Yeah, true. Yeah, I'm not off, I'm not, Propositioning you for some kiss where I may or may not turn into a prince. Yeah, it, sounds, it sounds like that. <laughs> I've got, I'm, I'm in the green check for frog right now. Mmm, <laughs> for sure. What do you What do you do in London? Um, oh, also, London. sorry, are you free right now? Or no. I, need to I know it's a Sunday. Sunday. So I'm going to meet my friend. Okay, um, not literally one second. Well, that, that, not one second. That will literally that, on my that will break my heart if you cut me off mid sentence just to fuck off. Really it would break your heart. It would, yeah, it would break my heart. Like two minutes ago. Is that what you do? You break hearts? <laughs> you don't talk to her boys, but when you do... <laughs> You're saying all the classics, yeah. yeah. All the classics? Yeah. Really? Your heart wow, you wow. You should be in the street. <laughs> You're killing me. I thought I was being original. No, you heard it all, you heard it, you heard it all before. What, what are you doing in London? Just working. Yeah? What do you do for fun? What do you, what do you love to do? I'm feeling I'm, so on the spot right I now. I want to know. I want to know. I want to know about you. Thank you. 
Yeah. Okay. Um, What's your book? Tell What's your book? Um, oh, I got them on stock X. Okay. Okay. I, do, um, I like um, I like reading, but I don't read any fantasy or anything. I just I only read self-help. It's really boring. I like isn't it? Really? What's your favourite? I don't have a favourite. I just oh, like you're one of them. So. They're all like they're all your babies. How could you pick between your hun <laughs> no, hun hundred it's, babies? It's not that. I just think. Um, mm, it's the right book at the right time. Exactly. Uh, yeah, exactly. Yeah. I feel like you need to read it at the right time. Although I've, I've only read four Harry Potters, so I don't have that against me. I, I, don't know, I don't know if that's a deal breaker. <laughs> I know a lot of people feel very strongly you should have read the seven. Well, or eight. Those, yeah. Okay, well, I feel, like, I feel very strongly you should have read at least the first four. So I am holding that against you. You have a good day. Like, Fuck this. <laughs> I've watched the film already. Who gives a shit what happens to Harry? I feel like when you've watched the film first, it's hard to go back and read the book. But if you read the book first, it's fine. Yeah. Well, that does make sense, but then if you were to do that to the Game of Thrones series, you'd have really fucked yourself. Is that books? Yeah, they're all based off books, aren't they? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Still break a few. Yeah. <laughs> have a good day, You're man. like, what is going on here? Yeah, I'm like, God, this guy don't have a TV, that is a huge red flag. Um, I actually have to go because okay. I've just missed the course for my, for my friends. So. Okay, well listen, um, I'm up here like semi-regularly. Can I take your number? Yeah, sure. Yeah? I'm only going to send you emojis, nothing crazy. <laughs> emojis? Yeah. <laughs> Don't do that, please. Do you not, do you not <laughs> chat in like prescriptive emojis? Probably, yeah. yeah. Like, then you can interpret the symbolism of them. Are you single, by the way? Yeah. Okay, I'm <laughs> checking. I don't want to be like a. Uh, what do you call that? I it? think I'd be concerned for myself if I was doing that. Yeah, worse. Well, some people, some people might. I don't want some like you know huge beam of a guy chasing me down the street and being the shit. <laughs> you ain't, you ain't worth that. Yeah, well, fuck you. <laughs> All right. Well, well listen. It was, nice to meet you. it was lovely meeting you. You have a lovely day. Yeah, okay. Lovely day. Bye. All right, nice one. So you've come out of a conversation there. So it was essentially the first proper conversation that you had. Um, for, like, for like five, six weeks. For like yeah. five or six weeks. <laughs> yeah. So like, just explain it to us, because in terms of how you were feeling in the conversation, mm. how you felt before it, mm. just, just tell the guys how you actually felt. Well, this is like a, that, this is like a classic. Uh, that, that would be exactly, that was very representative, exactly how I am. I'm very slow, I'm very weak at getting started. Mm -hmm. But then once, I'm, then once I've started, though, I'm actually... I'm, I can hold a conversation, I can take the piss, I can kind of like balance what I would just say vibe, energy, like, you know, not too inquisitive, a bit playful, challenge, I don't know, whatever, however people want to analyze that. I just, I just kind of go with vibe and it goes well, I put a smile on their face, uh, it's absolutely fine, but I don't, you know, what do you say, what, what's the thing you say where it's like, I, you know, I want you, but I don't need you, mm -hmm. and you can just, you know, if it goes, it goes and whatever, but you're just standing there. Now, nowadays, I'm very like, I'm very chill, I'm very relaxed. Like, you wouldn't think that. You think, I used to be like, yeah. Oh, when hey, you, hey, when you first came to me, yeah. do you remember, like, that was the main sticking point? We had to take you from social to seductive. Because you're really good conversationally. Yeah. But it's how to actually say a bit less mm. and almost let your seductive side come out so she can actually feel that, that masculine essence that you've got. Yeah, I'd have been like, where are you? Where do you live? What are you from? What's your age? Or what do you, what do, you do? Whereas now I'm just like, right, okay, what, what do you do? Okay, and then some free word association. I like, they're like, oh, I've walked my dog. I like a dog. I saw it once. It was in a film. It was good. How about you film dog good? <laughs> I like dogs as well. Yeah. I like cats. <laughs> yeah, right, go on. When I game as well, right, I do this thing where I have to, I bottle them and it almost like it winds me up and then I go. Okay. Which is like, it's really fucking annoying, but it's like a bad habit I guess I've let myself fall into. So in terms of you'll see someone, you won't do it, and yeah. then that'll be your motivation. And then for I'll the just be like, one. oh my god, you're such a pussy. And, and then, then but then does that actually make you do the next yeah, one? Yeah, but it's it does. Just, but it means there's this whole like wasted time in the beginning where I'm just like, oh my god, like you're such a pussy, and then I'll go. And it's like you could have just done this whole thing to begin with. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, no, I get that. I mean, I mean, yeah. I mean, quicker solution for that is just go when you don't want to. <laughs> yeah, just literally. use use that as a reason to do it. Yeah, literally. Because just say to yourself before you even do it, like you're a pussy, be like before you've bailed, yeah. and then just go and do it because you don't want to feel like that. Um, having a, having a, a zero second rule is good as well. Just yeah. saying, fuck it and going. Just I letting know, your legs man. carry you. I know, man. The thing is, it's like it's by far the thing I'm just the worst. It's my worst part, I'd say. I think and that I, can help though, being, just being more decisive in everyday life. Mm -hmm. So I think a lot of people in everyday life are very indecisive. Yeah. I think if you make a habit out of just making a decision quick and going after it, 
I think now I'll translate more into this. It's just like, see it, do it, see it, do it. Yeah, maybe something I really need to like sit down and really drill myself on. Yeah, I think just, yeah, having well, more of a... Uh, when, I, when I first started, I was fucking beating myself up like, you can't even do step one. Like, oh my God, like this is literally the first bit. You've got so much to do afterwards. Yeah. But what I realized as well is like, you can be shit at the first part. Yeah. And really, and like really good at the end part. 100%. Like, do you know what I mean? Like they don't, it just, they don't necessarily, I'm sure they correlate a little bit, but like you can really jump, bounce around them. Yeah, like some, some guys, like such as yourself, you have really good conversation skills. It's just getting to the actual conversation. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So maybe you're, maybe you're open, sucks balls. Yeah, and you exactly. need to just be more decisive, more bold, have more 100%, conviction 100%. when you go in there. So that's yeah. good that you're aware of that. Yeah. It's like, right, let's just, just focus on the open. You know, and when I, you're first coming out here, just focus on doing that bit. Yeah, I agree. And I actually kind of like, uh, would label myself as like, some guys can be really bold or whatever, but I'm quite empathetic and right. like, social and socially conscious aware blah 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 mm -hmm. and that's I think that's where I get the benefit from having good conversation really investing in people okay but then it's that I then get the con of it is where I'm then very conscientious of like oh am I wasting their time or oh did it, are they better than me did yeah. it, do you know yeah. what I mean it's a bit of a double-edged sword um, but then and understanding that as a concept has actually been quite useful okay but I think that is human nature where you put your personality into a box and then you believe it's static it's like yeah. oh I'm this sort of person well, it's just a way you've practiced being for a long time. It's yeah. become habitual. The reality is you could be a different way if oh, you wanted mate. to be. All, and you can bring different parts of your personality out. Oh, all right. Fuck it. Oh, hey, ladies. Hey, sorry. I'm sure you're like in a rush. Are you? Yeah. Can I stop you for like one second? Well, fair play for going in for that. Thanks, bro. Because, um, yeah, I mean, most people would avoid twos. Well, you know what it was? We walked past the two, and I was like, oh, I don't want to do that. And, okay. then I, and then I was like, oh, but actually, like, you, you definitely, it's definitely, you definitely could. Mm. And then kind of once it's in your head, it's kind of like festering a little bit, you know? Yeah, I think there's a point in which it still festers, and then you do lose it eventually. But whilst it's still fresh in your mind, you still do have a window of opportunity to seize it. Yeah, like when you, because when you first start out, I'm not, I, and when I first start out, I'm not thinking, oh, let's fucking jump into like twos and threes. Yes. Me, because I've like, I, like I said, like I really, like, I don't really, but I struggle more so with that part. But then once you're warmed up, once I'm warmed up a little bit, mm. that's when I can go, hold on a minute, this is possible. Mm. Yeah, there's a difference between I can't and I won't. Yeah. It's like, but even just doing that, just to just to break the ice for yourself socially, and just show show yourself you actually can. Yeah, that's a good exercise, you know, just to just to do it, just for the sake of doing it, because you know it's going to make you feel better, regardless of what actually happens with it. And there was like these people here on my left, they're like some guys and whatever, and like that. I'm like again spotlight approaching. That's all that same shit that I don't really like. Yes. Or I'm probably my worst part of my game. But last, like, oh, they're there as well. Uh huh. So I can push through that. Yep. And it's all good. To rate that session for myself out of 10, I'd give myself like a six. Mm -hmm. So it's like, obviously, when you see other people do your thing, your ego wants you to be seen as like, oh, you're so good. Like, oh my God, look at you, you're so great. But I think it's actually a fair representative, a fair representative that realistically, you come off a little hiatus, mm. you've got all these new factors going around, not to like make excuses at all. I think that's a, I think that's a, I think that's a reasonably fair representation. Yeah, I think that's an accurate appraisal. I think you, because you hadn't done it for a little while, yeah. we wanted to capture you doing this raw. Yeah. And is there anything in particular that you would recommend to guys, let's say the guy's watching this. Maybe he's never done it before, or maybe he has done it before, but he feels like a beginner again because he's been lazy and not done anything. Yeah, yeah. What would you say to that guy who wants to come out here, but he's feeling shit scared to do it? See, that's the thing. It's really, it's really interesting because I, I think about this because you get obviously on the internet, whatever, in these communities, you get lots of the same advice, but I feel like everything needs to be so contextual mm -hmm. to the individual, where they're at, the type of personality they are. Um, so I think there's a certain element of like just being able to figure that stuff out for yourself, right? Um, like for you, if you haven't been out for a little while, mm -hmm. the like I know the advice for you would be, don't be a pussy, mm -hmm. just fucking do it. Mm -hmm. And you, you respond to that mm -hmm. really well. Mm -hmm. Whereas if you told me that, and when I first started out, stop being a pussy, just do it. Mm -hmm. It's too much, mm -hmm. you know? Like, you're, mm -hmm. I'm just, like it's, you're, you're whipping me and it's like, no, I can't deal with that. 
So you're going to have to have a level of self-awareness. For me, uh, after I'd seen you, I found myself like a little crew. Mm. And then obviously, okay, right, you've got support, you're egging each other on, you're not worried about like physical altercations because that's obviously what your, your brain's going to be telling you. Like, oh my God, like people could be throwing hands, boyfriends jumping out the walls to like beat the shit out of you. Mm -hmm. So for me, when I first started out, I was moving heaven and earth to meet people, same objective, they support me, I support them. Um, and, that got, and that got me going. Find people that will actually support you. Start having people around you that are gonna, you can talk to, that believe in you. And it's almost like you're beginning to grow that kind of like, um, so, you're beginning to grow socially there, right? Mm -hmm. And then from there, whatever it takes, meeting people online, starting really small. Everyone's done like the cash register thing or stopping people, hi, you look nice. Mm -hmm. Whatever it takes, just find something you can do, do it. Yeah, I think for guys watching this, because obviously, like you say, everyone is in their own unique position. Mm. Some people have a lot of resistance. Some people are just being lazy. Some people are just being pussies about it, especially if they know they can already do it. We got moved over because the security guard didn't like us, but it's okay. Um, but no, as we were saying, in terms of if you're a guy who's watching this and you're feeling very socially anxious at the moment, just focus on the next practical thing you can do. Mm. So maybe that's just going outside and going to a busy area. You don't even have to do any conversations, but it's actually being in a busy area. Just like we are right now, mm. like we're just talking to a Camera. That's a really good social exercise as well. Yeah, I don't like get, this. You yeah. can, if you can get a friend mm. to go out with you and just to, to hold the camera with you, yeah. just to put the spotlight onto you a little bit more, mm. it can help overcome that resistance of being yeah. seen. I agree. Be kind to yourself and take little steps. Yeah. yeah. Baby step that shit. Baby step it. Yeah. But you had a good time? Yeah, yeah, it was good. Good, good to be out we, there. We appreciate you. Mate, yeah. We, I'm glad I'm kind of. Hopefully this, you know, they like this video. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> give, yeah, give yourselves, don't plan it after that. Fuck, yeah. oh, fucking hell, this is the coach. Channel's gone downhill, mate. <laughs> Who's this guy recruiting? <laughs> you can't even teach a front stop, this guy. <laughs> but yeah, if you want to undergo a similar experience like George has undergone, then you know what to do. Drop us an email, ukdaygamingg.com. And any closing thoughts before you say au revoir? No, listen, guys, honestly, be yourself. just be yourself. Be yourself and go for what you want. Easy, have fun. That's all you need. And stay sexy. Mm, stay sexy. You stay sexy, yeah? <laughs> you stay sexy, okay? You stay sexy, okay?